I guess it's a plastic, in a plastic, in a container, in a newspaper, and in a plastic. Camouflaged with my bed. <laughs> so this is a package now. Don't even ask why there are molts on my floor. Yeah, that's how messy I am. I remember one person commented on my Facebook page saying my room is so super neat. This is just one part of my bedroom. Yeah, molts on the ground. Don't judge. Back to the package. So we usually unbox what? Spiders, tarantulas, trapdoor spiders, cockroaches, mm, scorpions. Yep. This is something a little bit different. It's something that you guys never really see in my collection well this is you'll see I've got to use the scissors for this because oh by the way can you hear water yeah I'm not sure if you can hear I've got to use the scissors because it's like wrapped oh it doesn't even have a box it's like wrapped in newspaper itself and the newspaper is like damp it's Chinese writings on it but yeah let's get this open real quick because I want to see how this guy is doing this is the first time I'm receiving a package like this. Usually we get packages like boxes, right? We get tarantulas, scorpions, everything else in boxes. But this is pretty much just a newspaper wrapped in this blue thingy. So yeah, I've got to use the scissors. Wrapped in tape, I believe. There is... Okay, I thought that the newspaper was covering the entire thing. There's actually a container in here. A plastic container. Turn this up real quick. Hope this little guy is okay. Okay, almost there. It's a really big container. Wow, I'm really impressed at how this thing is packed. Well, I mean, it's so simple. It's just a container. Oh, there's a plastic in there. Okay, it's a plastic in a container, in newspaper, in a plastic bag. Very, very interesting. This is also my first time receiving this kind of animal through postage. Yep, it's kind of new to me, so that is why I'm a little bit surprised. Why isn't this thing opening? Are you serious? How do you put the thing in here? Oh my gosh. All right, there we go. Yeah, I think you guys already know what's in here. Kind of obvious, isn't it? So, um, yeah, I thought that the water was black, but no, it's it's just the plastic bag. I guess it's a plastic in a plastic in a container, in a newspaper, I mean, in some newspapers, and in a plastic. Let's open this. I hope the water doesn't spill out because that will not be fun. My floor is wood, and if water, like, spills here, hmm, yep, not something I want happening. I shouldn't even be doing this over here. I should be doing it like outside, but well, YOLO. <laughs> Sorry if the camera's a little bit shaky. I'm not used to opening packages like this. Usually tarantulas are so different when it comes to opening, but yeah. We can't see the animal yet. Why is it like covered in black tape at the bottom? Okay, wait, let me tilt it over and tilt it upside down and we'll see whether we can see the little guy. Yes, there it is, you guys. <laughs> So this, guys, okay, wait, my hand is slipping off. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, this is a beautiful, beautiful flower horn fish. Whoa, check out those colors. Yeah, my, my, my hand's a little bit slipping again. This thing is so slippery, what? Okay, this is a flower horn and it's gorgeous. It's like super gorgeous. I mean, really, hand? Look at that, look at that, you guys. It's literally slipping off. <sighs> but yeah, these guys are those fishes with the big horns on the head. I don't know if you guys have these in your country but they're quite common over here so yeah I got one for myself this one was about hmm, $35 yeah around there stop slipping but there's our new addition guys new addition to the exotics lair I don't even know how these guys are shipped and this flower horn is still I don't know let's say four inches they'll get maybe a good eight inches or so I don't know but we'll see we'll update you guys with this little fish but yeah I'm gonna be waiting for feet boy to come over mr. feet because that guy he knows quite a bit about fishes so he's gonna help me rehouse this little guy. Now I'm gonna have to bring my German Shepherd Zina over to the vet because she needs her vaccination. Is that what you call it? Yep, vaccination, her third one. She needs four, so we'll be back. Hello. Stop giving her stones. Zina. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go. Zina. Don't jump. We're outside. 
So it dried up? Uh, what's it called? Melted and burned. Melted and what? Okay, I think the fish is ready to go home. Okay, let's go. You're doing all the work. I'm doing all the film. Somewhat work. <laughs> <laughs> all right, don't put that water in though. Yeah, I know. Add more water from the tank. Pour it into the toilet bowl straight away. And then you add more, and then you pour out. Yup, all right, go pour it into the toilet. And that is what the toilet is for. Not for pooping, but pouring water. Don't pour the fish in. Oh, no. No, what? No, 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 no. No, cover it with your hand. I'm, Jeez, I'm if the fish head. falls in I'm there. I'm blocking his head. I mean, you're blocking his head. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, no, no. No. I just put him in. No, don't no. pour the water no, in. No, no. Oh, my gosh. It's so small. Yeah. It's a chichlet! <laughs> Sickly! Sickly! <laughs> chichlet! <laughs> He's happy. Male or female? Looks like a male. Hopefully it's a male. Come here, little chichlet. So you're sexist, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> How? <laughs> How? <laughs> Just pour it here. That's a massive tank for such a small little guy. Three weeks later, and look at this guy. He has grown so much, and his colors are more prominent now. Hey, where are you going? Can you please stop? And now we're gonna see if he eats some pellets. Not really sure if he'll come up. Oh, here he comes. And there he goes. Yeah. Having his meal. Woo. He is doing super, super well, as you can see. Usually, as soon as I enter my room, he will be here waiting for food. It's just, hey, hey. It's just that today he didn't come up waiting for me, but usually he's over here waiting and as soon as I drop food in, he will be there to eat it. So yeah, these guys are awesome, awesome fishes.